Have to get to prison and take out guards. Have anything helpful? You all right? Everything's fine, but this fellow snores so loud and stinks like a camel. Only have this shirt. Sorry. A shirt? Well, I suppose Jamila could strangle the guard with it. I need to come up with something a little bit more Theodorish. The steps are ready. The shirt is dripping. Let's see if this helps me any further. Might work. Damn gloomy in there. It has to be the torture chamber. Full of machines with cranks and hooks and... There are two other doors. That could be the cells. But how am I going to get in there? Hello? Anyone there? Ramon? I can't see a thing. A anyone there? Hello? Ramon? Hmm. Theodore? Is that you? Yes! Yes, it's me! Theodore? I never thought I'd see you again. You know me. You don't get rid of me that easily. And now I'm going to get you out of here. And I thought you were glad to be rid of me. Oh, Forget all that stupid arguing. Let's get you out of here first. Us? There's two of us. I don't know how many others are being kept prisoner in the other cells here. Me neither. The cells are all barred and locked. There's not a bit of light that can get in. Can't you get any closer to the door? I can hardly hear you. Ah! Oh! Ramon? Are you not well? Did they torture you? It's the old wound from the flying machine crash landing. It's inflamed. My whole leg's throbbing. Damn it! You have to get out of here as soon as you can! We. Oui. Yeah, yeah, I'm doing what I can. Ramon? Who else is with you? The Emir. The former head of the city of Tripoli. Quite correct. I've been a prisoner here for seven years, since the Spaniards occupied the city. How are you both? You've been stuck in here the longest of them all, yes? Yes, anyway, at least I'm still sitting up, as opposed to your brother. He's got a fever, he's not at all well. I'll look after him in a minute. I just need something to get the door open. Forget the crowbar. Better look for a key, because believe me, without that, you just aren't going to get the door open. I was personally involved in the construction of these cell doors, they are absolutely break-in and break-out proof. I wanted them like that. And it has to be said I certainly got what I wanted. Right then, get the key. Ramon, did you hear? I'll do that. Just hang in there. I fear he can no longer answer. His fever has got worse. Zezura. Zezura. What? What's he saying? He's fantasizing about the lost desert city. He's mentioned it a lot these last few days. Zezura, whatever. The most important thing now is to get the key. That looks... nasty. What is it? <coughs> the...
The spearhead is pretty sharp. The crank from the grinding wheel. The barrel's broken. Only the lid and the base are solid. That used to be a whetstone, probably for sharpening torture instruments. The chains are riveted to the wall, but there are a few hooks here. I could definitely use them. Now I can hang anything I like on them. Still got the hooks to get on, then I don't need much more. Now then, hooves up! If I put that here, and then that here, then I've got a drill! It's holding, but I can't push it yet. Up you go. Now I might be able to drag it a couple of cubits at least. Now I can push the thing. What's that? A horse with a saddle made of sharply angled steel. I just hope Ramon's been spared that. 
Now, we want to see if this thing might still be of some use. I've got the horse hooked onto the chains now. I can put the axles to one side now. The horse is hanging on the chains. fits too. That's going to make one powerful projectile. Hasta la vista, compañero. No key on him. Damn. I'll take it with me again. Jamila, psst. Here, this is for you, with best wishes from the prison guard. Theodore, you just get better and better. I know. Now all I need is the key to the prison. Then we can... What are you whispering for? There's somebody there! Get away from the window! Away from the window, I said! Are you deaf? Right then. I'll show you who's the master around here. And I'll show you whose daughter I am. There! Take that, you cursed murderer! Would these be the keys you're looking for? I... I think they are. I've got the key to the cell. Now let's get off to get Ramon.
Ramon, my dear brother. Theodore! The fever has gone down, but we need water, food. Yes, we're leaving here immediately. Open up the other cells first, please. There are other prisoners. You're free! Come on out! Come on! Hey, what's going on here? Have you been partying without me? Rafi, where have you come from all of a sudden? I climbed over the wall. Where's Jamila? In the palace. We're not finished with the guards. There's two of them running around still. Good. Then there is something for me to do. I've got a saber. You take Jamila's for now. Hey! The prisoners have broken out! Help! The devils are free! How quickly the tides can turn. Good work, you two. That went quicker than I thought. I've heard you say that once before, only this time it sounds much nicer. And now? Well, there's those two in the prison to be dealt with, and then we're out of here. Or do you want to weave yourself a victor's laurel wreath? But where are we supposed to go? To the hideout first, and then you can discuss what's next. I'm so happy you're getting better, Ramon. All of you. We have to thank you for that, Theodore. We wouldn't be sitting here if it weren't for you. Um, while you were having your fever, you mentioned something about a city. Yes, Zerzura, the legendary desert city, which is in no way lost, as many maintain it is. It is only uninhabited. The only person living there is the Queen. The inhabitants have all been scattered to the four winds, but they'll find their way back, and quite soon, since it's the longing for their home that draws them back. And not only that. What do you mean? There is something which binds the inhabitants to their city. It's the water which they drank as children, and which still has an effect on them. Water which can heal all wounds, and which gives the Zazurians unlimited life force. Where do you know all this from? From the Zazurians themselves. Drinking the water has a small side effect. The hair turns white, and the eyes grow brighter. Yes, we are Zezurians. You too. But my hair's black. Because you have never drunk the water. At least not directly. Our mother was pregnant with you when she had to flee Zezura. But your eyes are just as bright as ours. But I don't understand. I know, Theodore. That's because you've never felt this longing in yourself. But I have. You know that I've spent my whole life looking for a reason for it. And now, now that I know it, I don't want to spend one more day without a home. You want to go to Zezura? Seriously? All of us. <coughs> but you're all ill, completely unfit to travel. We can certainly find a good physician in Tripoli. There is only one medicine that can heal us. But how do you see this working? If you're right, then this city lies somewhere out in the desert. You don't even have the strength to stand on your own two feet. How are you going to march through the desert day after day? And carrying provisions, water and all of that? We'll manage it. The thought of Zerzura will give us the strength. But that's ridiculous. It will be certain death for you. No, Theodore. It's our one chance of survival. I'll find the city and then find the shortest route and then come back and get you. But you don't know enough about it. That would be much more dangerous. I value your concern, dear brother. But trust me, I have freed you from the clutches of the Inquisition and will now also find the desert city, lost or not. We'll set forth in three days. No, not in three days. We have to hurry. We are not the only ones who wish to travel to Zerzura. 
The Grand Inquisitor will soon be setting out for there too, just as soon as he has found what he's looking for, and that won't be long now. What's that you're saying? The Grand Inquisitor wants to go to Zazura. That's why he was looking for us. He needs the key in order to get into the city. And then it will be too late for all of us. And where is this damned key? Nobody knows exactly. The key was broken into several parts and distributed among the Zazurians before their great flight, when they scattered to the four winds. But the Grand Inquisitor has been searching doggedly and with all means of force, and certainly has already collected some pieces together. Already got a few pieces? That means not all of them. I don't think he has. Quite definitely not. He was extremely angry when he saw that we didn't have any of the fragments. Yes, but any kind of information is useful to him. He's set off at full speed into the desert. Then we have to find the missing pieces, before he does. Then let's go! What are we waiting for? <laughs> 